This guy tried in and out Burger for the first time in his goddamn life this weekend. Tried in and out Burger, right? I flew in and my family member, I said, hey, I'm gonna get a double-double animal style. Should I get well-done fries or should I get animal style fries? And he says, listen, animal style fries is better, but you have to get well-done fries. So you know what the fries at least taste like. And I said, that checks out. So I got a double-double animal style and well-done fries. I'm gonna start with the fries because I think we all know what this is. Um, the fries kind of suck. That's not anything new, but like, it's kind of like eating cardboard, you know? It's just, there's not a lot of flavor and I get it, they cut the potatoes right there. I understand, listen, I know in and out even though I've never been, I know, I know the slang. Still not very good. You gotta get your fries figured out. The burger on the other hand, <gasps> she that shit was so good, dude. So I figured out in and out burger is like every fast food burger that you've ever had put into one conglomeration of fast food burger goodness. Because when I ate it, I tasted the Big Mac. I tasted a Whopper. I, I mean, I tasted even Dairy Queen burger, like somewhere, somewhere deep in its trenches. They just took all the good shit that you like in a fast food burger and they made it one delicious late night drunken trophy. Definitely nine out of 10 on the burger fries, two out of 10. Stinky dog shit fries, boo. Animal style fries are probably way better though, but there's just yuck.